Hello. I am the summoner of robots, and joining me today is this half-track vehicle that I built. It's called a half-track because it has half wheels and half tracks. Let's take a look inside. So, you may notice, these are LEGO Mindstorm's motors. This one is controlled using the same uh, strategy with a RC motor controller that I've used for my other LEGO Mindstorm's robot projects. There's probably a curve up there that you can click on. Um, this one, however, that does the steering, is secretly a servo motor. Here's how I did that. Over here, Right here, that is the control circuitry from a standard-sized servo. Now, that, that servo has an input from a potentiometer to tell it where the motor is, and an output to the motor to move the motor to where it should be. So, I have a potentiometer up here that I've soldered onto wires that run to the potentiometer contacts on here. Then, the contacts for the motor are wired into this motor. So it works just like a regular servo, except all the parts are strewn out everywhere. The sensor is over here, the motor is here, the control circuitry is here. So it's kind of weird, but it actually works really well. And then I've got that geared down so that it has a reasonable speed and such over there. I'll plug this in and demonstrate it. The motor that's used for forward and backward propulsion is bound to the elevator channel on my transmitter. So I can push forward to go forward, and pull backwards to go backwards. It doesn't have the best traction on my desk, though. Then on the rudder channel is the steering, which is that servo I, t I was talking about earlier. That is just... it operates like a normal servo. You push it to the left, and it goes left. You push it right, and it goes right. It's very loud, and it's slow, also. I did have it working faster originally, but that would cause the servo to oscillate around the neutral point, and I decided that slow was better than oscillating back and forth. Also, a side note, this cover is just foam board, and it's painted in this camouflage pattern by taking painter's tape and cutting it into patterns and then just painting alongside that. Well, I guess that's it for today. Until next time, I'm the Summoner of Robots, this is the LEGO Half-Track Vehicle, and thank you for watching.